Okay, guys, I have here a very large box of merchandise from Limited Run Games. So I'm going to open it up and let's see what's in here. <laughs> okay, well, that worked. Oh, wow. There's a lot of good-looking bubble wrap here. Okay, let's see. First up. We have... Shantae, still in the box, very lovely. I gotta say, this is a very nice looking box. Uh, like, it's all graphic, you got the transformations on the back. Very good stuff. And then next up, we have Risky's Revenge. Director's stuff still in the box. Very much a nice looking box. It's also holographic. Unfortunately, no transformations on the back, but still looks very good. Let's see. Next up. Let's see, what is left? I think this is the, uh, Game Boy cartridge. It has a little, uh, Game Boy color cartridge on the side. So I'm going to assume that's what this is. I'm going to be very excited to get into that. Oh, and we have another little box here. Let's see. I think this is Game Boy Color. Compatible with the retro handheld, as it says on the back. Yeah, so this must be the original Shantae. Let's see. Play on Game Boy Advance system for enhanced color and to unlock hidden secrets. Ooh! I'm definitely gonna check out those hidden secrets. Okay, and then here, we have a cover that would be holding the game. Let's see, they included some limited run. I guess these are kind of like flyers. And these are like those old school flyers that you can unfold. And. Maybe two of them. So, Limited Run Games, thank you for that. Let's see, what have we here? So, we have Risky's Revenge Director's Cut for Nintendo Switch. We have the original Shantae. For Nintendo Switch. And we have two very lovely steelbook covers. So we have for Half Genie Hero, the Ultimate Edition. Let's see. How do I get into it? There we go. It has the monkey transformation inside. Might be a little hard to see because of the glare. And then, that means we have one other seal book here. This would be for Pirate Search. So, if I had to guess, they probably have 
some kind of pirate cream inside. No, actually, inside, they have little squid hearts, if you can see it. Uh, yeah, probably gonna be a little hard. And the back actually has pirate saute on it. Very good stuff there. Now, if I can just not drop things, that would be fantastic. So I'll just slip these back into my little box. Let's see, make sure I put them in the right order. No, it'll bother me if I don't. Two, that's number three, that's number four. Let's see, put it that way so I can see the name of the game. Okay, let's see. Moving on. Oh, these things are kind of weird looking. Oh, I, I know what these are. If I'm looking at them correctly. And if I can just look this through. Get through the bubble wrap. So actually what we have here is a vinyl version of the Rissy's Revenge Director's Cut soundtrack. And there's actually two discs in here, if I am understanding this correctly. I will take a look on that. That's what it says on the back. Yeah, it says here, so just one side A, main titles, file select, she's got move, shuttle town, orly yarly, risky boot, burning town, side B, through the trees, buy something, item fanfare, adventure, cavern, sand in my potion, serious genie business, Carry through Labyrinth. Just two. Solve the puzzle. Danger. Ver. Boss battle. A seal approaches. Collecting a seal. Day travel. Let's make a meal. Hall of Magic. Try again. The Labyrinth. And then D. Now, which is the final disc. We have the final challenge, the last battle, and credit, Burning Town Forever. And all the music was composed by legendary composer Jake Hoffman. So yeah, here's the back, where you fight, I, I can't remember the name of that enemy, but I remember they were, in fact, very, very annoying. So I will just set that aside, and that is the last of it. Wait, no. Hold on. Something fell out. Now yeah, this must have been with the vinyl, and I just did not see it. But, we have limited run training cards. So we have... Actually, I'm going to need to open them, because it looks like there's a few in each pack. But we have Shante from Game Boy Color. We have... Another Shante from Game Boy Color. Looks like that's our Fire Magic. Let's see, this is a repeat Shante. Next, we have... So I can just get the card. Okay, another Fire Shante. Here is Shante, Rishi's Revenge, Director's Cut. Oh, 
Oh, nice. We, this is the Shantae Mega Bundle card. And that appears to be Seven Sirens artwork. And they give you a bonus card, too, I believe. And this one is the King of Fighters 98 Ultimate Map. We have Shantae, this is Revenge. Director's Cut, but a different one. And now I will very carefully open this pack. Alright, I see where to open it. I'm just very much struggling. My hand is a little shaky this morning. Okay. So these must be the gold print cards. And I got... Rishi from Rishi's Revenge. I have a very beautiful... Ronnie Top from Rishi's Revenge. And we have Beat Shantae from Rishi's Revenge. In the other pack, I have gotten. Oh, this pack was way easier to open. Okay, so I have. Hmm. First card is the original art for Rishi Boots. Then we've got Sky, the one who trains Warbirds. And lastly, we have another Ronnie Top. This is the original style for her. And now, that appears to be everything that I have gotten in my bundle. So yeah, if you like this, definitely stay tuned for more. I have two more bundles that will be coming to me in the slightly distant future. And I will be unboxing those as well. Until next time, bye everyone!